the latest version of the Chrome OS Flex brings in a lot of new features and it's been a while since I've made a video about the latest updates and it already found a new version because I'm on the Chrome OS uh, developer version as you can see on the quick toggle also it shows which version are you on uh, the new highlight I found was this uh, experimental feature on the top right corner in the lab section this is the new UI called the Chrome OS uh, refresh 2023 and it changes the design you can see some rounded corners but also adds this new customization menu uh, it is basically the same uh, style menu but now in a compact form and you can change the different colors and combinations also we have a lot of themes and built in some color combos You can also download themes from the Chrome Web Store and some of them are made by Google but we have third parties as well. The trash can was also added a few versions back. So now when you delete an item it does not just permanently get deleted but now you can restore it from the trash with a single click. You can see the restore icon up there and clicking it will restore the files to their original location and it works similar to that of the recycle bin on Windows so it's a good feature to have on the Chrome OS Flex as well. And for faster Bluetooth connections, Google Fastware was added. So if you have Google Buds or any earbuds that supports the Google Fastware, and it will appear like this and you can easily connect your devices. So it's a good new addition. Some of you were having error with the battery uh, indicator. You can see it shows the battery full and it also shows the battery remaining as well. So it's working. And when you hover over the maximize Menu, you can see this new multitasking window so you can uh, snap uh, apps to one side of the screen to easily multitask it, it works like uh, the feature we have in the windows 11 and the new feature is also that we have this float menu so now the app will float over other applications so if you have a media playing it would be really helpful in that case so a nice addition for easy multitasking and um, just to overall increase your productivity uh, it was a must feature had to have and now it has been added and uh, you can see that the update has been applied and we can simply restart it and it's one of the uh, best feature of Chrome OS in general and the, in the accessibility if you are having issues with the touchpad you can go to this uh, uh, keyboard and touchpad and change this some settings uh, some of you have called complaining about touchpad so you can enable or disable some of these settings to fix the issue and i've noticed also in the audio section we have new startup sound so it is, plays a little jingle when you, the chromos flex uh, boots up so that's also good addition uh, i also noticed this placeholder of empty some sort has been left here so they might add something in future builds so that is something to look forward to in the wallpaper section we do not see any new addition um, but i wanted to show you this how cool this looks the day and night transition it looks something like from the apple devices and another new addition i found was in the screen recording you can see when i'm clicking there's a little animation on the cursor so you can enable it from the uh, screen recording settings so you can access the screen recording from the quick toggles or you can press the print button and in the gear icon you will see this option as shown in this image it shows, shows click and this will enable that cursor animation and you can check out this new keyboard design uh, it looks much similar to that of Gboard and it has been redesigned with the new animations and we have the emoji, the clipboard, uh, the handwritten and the voice command as well you can also minimize the keyboard and it looks pretty cool so if you have a touch screen laptop this will work really good and it's nice they have working on to improve this you have this gesture typing as well so those were some of the new features i found in the chrome os flex latest version if you have something more to add leave them in the comments and uh, thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one